Canyon just released this bike right now and they even gave me a custom color on it. This is insane. Hello everyone. Today is gonna to be epic. So you've just arrived at Canyon HQ because I've got a brand new bike to pick up and they said it's mega special and this is the first time I'm gonna see it and I'm well excited. Look at that. Oh my God, this is what I designed. Look, this is ridiculous. That is the best paint job I've ever seen. This has come from my old school days of being called Leopard Head. If you know that far back in my career, then you are an OG, but look at that, that is so cool. When we were last in Europe at the main Canyon office with all the other pro riders, they gave us a piece of paper with a blank frame on it and said, design a frame and that's what I designed. I never thought that it was gonna become a reality. Sick. So this beautiful looking frame here is the Spectral On Fly. This is a brand new bike. This is a super lightweight e-bike and we're gonna get it built now and then go and shred it today for the first time. So excited. But next to us here is all the stuff. Look, it's even been laid out nicely. I've never seen such a clean setup ready to go. Look, we've got the discs, the motor, the brakes, the gearing, the bars. And we're gonna go straight in with the forks here which are completely brand new. So we're gonna to have to do actual cutting down and real mechanics. I don't see many curbs in here and hammers to use, but I'm sure we'll make it happen in some way or another. Right, we're gonna put all this on. So then I can see how much of the fork we need to cut down. Then it's time to migrate to the next room. This looks strange. Look, I've never used one of these before. Actually. Hmm, that might have been easier than the pipe cutter. Right, unfortunately there's no curbs in Canyon to sand down with, so we might actually use a real sanding device. Oh my God, this is, this is wrong, isn't it? Like, what's going on? <laughs> now it's time for the star nut here. Oh my God, that's annoyingly easy. <laughs> Look at that, that's the best. We're going so pro with this. Bit of grease in there. Oh my goodness, like a glove. That is made for it, so good. Bars then, let's get them on. Boom, there we go, bars are on. Now it is time for this tiny little powerful beast. This is a TQ motor, lightweight, loads of power, and we're gonna just wedge that in here. See, I'm so pro, I know exactly what I'm doing. You make sure the TQ logo is facing up. Wedge that in there. Where's the hammer when you need it? Then we just cross thread that in there. Right, there we go. That is the motor in. So now we gotta put on the chain ring onto the motor here. Fully greased, dreamy. Then we need this, and we're gonna do 50 newton meters of torque. Oh yeah, we're never gonna, how are you gonna, oh, we need a crank arm on, don't we? Oh, put a hole through it. Oh, was that it? Done it. <laughs> Easy. Front brake here. This is a new SRAM code one. Front brake on. We've got a mud guard actually that fits on the fork and looks all steezy and stuff. Right, it's now time for the derailleur and this is an epic one because it's Wi-Fi. We're now getting to the exciting moment. We're putting on the wheels. These are the Halo Gravitas wheels and I've got the Goodyear Newton tires on already. So it's even quicker for the shredding. Yep, done. Now we need some discs. Oh yeah, look at that. Magic that disc straight on. Now we can get fitting. Then even more fun pedals, look. Love these Canyon pedals, they're actually amazing. I've got some peel grips here. Loads of them. Because I didn't know what colour the bike was going to be, I've brought a load of them. I think I'm going to go white and black mixed. Yeah, that's going to work. Steez on there, I think. Then, of course, the Ergon SM Enduro saddle. After a full morning of building this bike from completely the ground up, I present to you the fully finished Canyon Spectral on fly in my custom colorway. Look at this, that is so cool. I didn't even know I was gonna have a custom painted bike and then I turned up to this completely brand new one and it is unbelievable. What a sick looking machine. Thank you so much Canyon. 
but I can't stay any longer. I need to ride this machine and we're going to get out of here straight away and get in some action in the woods. Let's go. We've just made it to the woods and this thing is looking absolutely amazing. into the first trail then on this bike. Oh my goodness, almost missed it. Wooden one, yes. Wow. Whoa, more features. Oh, coming to that hot. Woo, yes. Oh, it's, oh my God, look at this. It's the seesaw to flat. <laughs> Oh my God, what a sick trail. Whoa, sick section. Ooh, very tech. Wow, yo, that's sick. Wow, oh look, big seesaw. Oh my goodness, what an insane trail for the first ride on my new bike. That is next level. That TQ motor is just the perfect amount of power and it makes the bike so light. It's like I'm literally riding a normal bike, but I've got the little boost of power there with the motor. This is incredible. Oh my God, let's go and find some more stuff to hit. We were just lazily driving to the next spot and I remembered this little skate park section. There's all these little bumps and stuff. We're gonna get a few, few of the first tricks this bike will ever have done out of that bump there. Right, we're now up the top overlooking Pisa. It's such a lovely view over there. Louis, as you can see, is gonna be following me, but the voices and noises you'll hear from me, unless Louis has a crazy moment, and then I switch to his audio. Ready, Louis? We haven't, we haven't ridden here for a while, so I'm not really sure where we're going, but that sort of direction, yeah? Sure. Full speed. All right, come on then. Wow, that's rocky. This is, oh my, ow. How is this a trail? This is where I crashed on that cheat bike challenge. Oh my God, it's kind of gnarly. Yes, Lou. <laughs> this hasn't been ridden, has it? Wait, that's not even a track anymore. <laughs> we made it back up. We found this little one here. Ready? I'll go sort of like cruisily fun, sort of out of control speeds, yeah? Nice, all right, here you go then. Driving. Whoa, I got, oh yes, Lou, I got throw. Oh, come on. This thing feels unreal, man. Right, it's actually nuts how normal bikey feeling this is. Incredible. It's getting dark though. It, I'll take that off actually. That's how dark it is in the woods. There we go, we smashed out a few laps. It did take quite a while to build this bike, so it's getting super dark in the trees there. But as a matter, we're gonna to move to tomorrow, get another session on this thing to finish off this video and just ride what is quite possibly the best bike I've ever had. In fact, it definitely is. Look at it. It's incredible. Let's go to tomorrow. It's now day two. We've come to Twisted Oaks Bike Park because it's sick. And secondly, it's super, super windy today. So we can ride my slope line, at least the bottom section here. Oh, we've got a spider, look. One of them fast, small ones. 
and we can ride the bottom section because it's in the trees and it shouldn't be too windy down there so we'll be able to blast out some tricks see what it feels like to flip hopefully get a few spins and just love how sick this bike is let's get on with it Just warmed up a bit on this top section it's super fun like i said it's well windy though so we can't ride the drop on that one because it's side on but we've got this feature you can just start there skip her over this and straight into the last one so we'll blast out some tricks on there louis is going to stand on the landing let's get it here we go then this is the like straight line into the jump boost that and then you just flow let's get a whip for louis That was so close. That was sick, Lou. Oh. Wow. That was cool. Let's give the bike its first backflip then. Stay up here, Lou. Get nice and tight. First flipper on this bike. Oh, wow. Oh, big. <laughs> Pumped quite hard into that. In fear. A fear pump for the first flipper. Let me flip no hander it, Lou. Flip tuck then. Whoa, that was perfect into the landing. I only get a flip can on it, Lou. Well, so far it's firing along. That is my favourite bike. It rides unbelievable. Like that is perfect for my style. Easy to go up, easy to trick insane uh i want to get a 360 this is quite a big jump for the first one but like i said for this is now the third time it's windy it's windy yeah i know but it is too windy and i would have done it on the mulch first but whatever let's get it on here lubes we don't need slow-mo we'll just go full speed here we go then oh wow yo oh wow yo that was quite scary actually 29 a front wheel just spins that little bit well quite a bit slower than the 26 slope bike but i've actually been riding the big bikes a lot more recently and after three in the talk on a few videos ago this just feels oh, it's so playful let's try and get them a bit more dipped so i'll do a couple more maybe we get a few slow motion ones oi, oi. Ab oh. oh yes that's better I went a bit to the side though. Oh yes. Oh, into that little cutty berm at the end. That's a sick little berm actually. Let's sabs then, Lou. Have a look. Let's have a look. Sav a look. Sabs. <laughs> Well, that's actually next up. That spins. Oh. There's like a slopey sort of, sort of like an old guy, really. That a simple 360 that just has that bit of lean in it oh, might be the best trick, actually. It, oh, might cry. I'm so happy. What a bike. What a jump. Like, what a world. <laughs> <laughs> after getting deep and for philosoph after getting philosophical about the world and that i have decided that i'm now going to try a superman on here straight superman louis low actually if he's low in the gap there you won't see if my body sort of pointed down slightly like the best supermans are like dead straight but mine are sort of not the best. It's like a weak flavoured Ribena, my one. You know, like a cordial that's not got enough in there, for you that call it cordial. Or like a flat fizzy drink or something. I'm not like a fully fizzed up Simon Godziak, but anyway, right, Superman. Oh, oh. oh my God. 
That was quite good actually, I'm stoked with that. I like let it dangle a bit, which created a sort of, this sort of flowing natural. <laughs> Let's do a slow motion one. Yes, Supermans. I don't do them enough. Just after about 10 goes and was able to get them actually looking how I'd love to have always done them. So see, practice makes perfect. I want to say a huge thanks to Canyon. This is actually a dream come true to get a custom paint job and on an e-bike of such, this kind of e-bike is literally perfect for me. Trickable, ride up and downable, just the perfect bike. And this is, this, this video has come out during the Swatch 9s event. If you don't know what that is, keep your eyes open. There's going to be lots of stuff on Instagram and the next few videos will be from that crazy event. See you in the next one. To the sky.